Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today is Monday and for dinner tonight we are having pasta. So I have my penne noodles here. I'm gonna use this Hunt's traditional pasta sauce and then I'm gonna be adding some meatballs. This is just the frozen Italian style meatballs that I get at Winco. It's the same one that I use every time. So right now I'm waiting for the water to boil. Once the water starts to boil, then I'll heat up the sauce and add the meatballs. All right, here's the pasta. I'm sure you guys have seen me make this a million times. Um, and then we're just gonna top it with some Parmesan cheese and I'm gonna add some red, uh, some crushed red pepper flakes. So today is Tuesday and for dinner tonight, we're having a couple of different things. Um, Ariel and I are going to be eating this fish. It's a marinated milk fish. It's already, uh, it's deboned. It's a Filipino one. Um, if you watched my Winkle haul, you would have seen it. So all you have to do is fry that. So I'm waiting for my oil to heat up. And then AJ's going to have a cheeseburger. So I'm frying up his hamburger right now. So here is AJ's cheeseburger. He just has lettuce and cheese and then mayo and ketchup on, I put it on the bun. And then he has some fries. These are the ones that we got at Winco. It's the Checkers brand, seasoned fries. So that's his dinner. So here's what the fish looks like, nice and crispy. I'm gonna have both of these and then I'm frying two more for Ariel. And then I also made this dipping sauce. Well, it's not a sauce, but I made this to go on the side. It's basically like pico de gallo, but a Filipino version, so it has fish sauce in it. It's fish sauce, lemon juice, tomatoes, onion, and jalapeno. So I'll eat that with the fish, and then Ariel will have it with rice. So that's dinner for Tuesday night. Today is Wednesday, and for dinner tonight, we are having pork belly adobo. I didn't cook, I didn't cook. I didn't film the cooking part of it, but I do have a recipe video. And I'm sure you guys have seen me make it many times, so I'll just leave the recipe video linked in the description. So all I'm having is just the meat, the pork belly, and some veggies, and then everyone else will have their adobo with rice. So that's our dinner for Wednesday night. Today is Thursday, and for dinner tonight, I am making a Filipino dish. It's called Ginisang Upo. This is the upo right here. Um, it's a type of gourd, and I think in English it's called a calabash. You can make this with ground pork, or shrimp, but I'm using ground beef because that's what I had. And you're also gonna need tomatoes, garlic, and onion. So I have everything ready. I have the garlic, onions, tomato, the upo, I peeled it, and then I cut them into rings, and then I cut each ring into four pieces, so it looks like that. I have my ground beef. I'm gonna make it in the wok. I'm just gonna start by sauteing the onions, the garlic, and then I'll add the tomato, and then I'll add the ground beef. And then I will be seasoning with fish sauce and also a little bit of uh, black pepper. So now that the ground beef is cooked, I'm gonna add in the vegetable. And then I will season with some fish sauce and some black pepper. Just gonna cook it until the vegetable is to my liking. So if you like it, you know, really soft, then just cook it for a longer time. So here is what the Ginisang Upo looks like. I'm just having um, a small bowl of it and then everyone else will have have it with rice so that's dinner for thursday night today is friday and for dinner tonight we are having nachos so this is vanessa's plate she has chips nacho cheese it's the tostitos one ground beef that i cooked in keto taco seasoning tomatoes jalapenos um guacamole and sour cream she has everything on it and then i'm just having a taco salad so i have lettuce at the bottom and then basically everything else that Vanessa has. And then AJ also has nachos, but it's more simple. Yeah. So yeah, that's our dinner for Friday night. Can you guys see that? It's just simmering because I'm letting the vegetables cook right now. And then here's the barbecue sticks that we got at the meat market and it came with sauce so you can brush it on while it's cooking. They have a lot of food, barbecue, lumpia, Bicol Express, caldereta, pancet, some latin, there's a lot of food. 